So there's so much power in these vision maps. I really just want you to understand. I want you to be able to take advantage of all of your potential. All right, I hope that was so helpful. I want to finish by showing you a couple of examples so you can see what this really looks like in real life. So this is an example of a vision board that I made for myself. I kind of made a few tweaks so I could share it with you. And it was something I started at the beginning of 2019. And you can see that I do the colors. It's colorful. I address different areas of life. This is business and um, this is family, spiritual, physical, vacation, friendships. This is my environment and specifically my marriage. And so I've used a few words and a few pictures in a very orderly manner. And I had to print this out again because as I attain things, I cut them off and save them in my book of proof. And, and so it's kind of fun though to look back and see what was I working towards. Now, I'll show you something really cool that, that I did with this. I have abundant friendships. Women call me for good things. So that was a specifically a point where I was like, I really want to have some more good friendships in my life. And so I set this as a goal in the beginning of 2019. And then I created, and I've done this in Canva. Um, it's a great tool that you can use to really customize and make your vision board easy. And, um, and so what I did is I took this picture See, this is the picture that was on my vision board. And then I went and I found incidences over the next few months of times that women did call me to do fun things. And it was so fun to, uh, to create a vision board of attainment. So here's another way that you can use a vision map or a vision board is that you can find the proof. You can say, hey, you know what? I did get that thing off my vision map. And look at, here's all the incidents. This is May and June and January. And, and then you can put this into your evidence binder or your book of proof and demonstrate, again, providing evidence to your subconscious. I do attain my goals. I am able, I am competent. And we're building identity as we do that. So important. Now, one other use, and I, I do this professionally, uh, my coaching and mentoring, and so I use this with my clients sometimes too. You'll find that there's lots and lots of different ways that you can use a vision map for things that you want to really get clarity and focus on in your life. Uh, and this is an example where I did this for a client. So I, I had an interview on a phone with a gentleman and he was in investments and banking and that kind of thing. And so he had, we talked a lot about career goals, but there was some Im important, family and spiritual goals and things like that that he did too. And so I went ahead and created for him a vision map. And so this is obviously not him. These are these are stock pictures, but um, he had trouble sleeping. So I imagined him sleeping well and um, setting an example and uh, traveling to where he wanted to go see Yankees games and, uh, and, and had some fitness goals and uh, some money goals and he wanted an assistant. And so I created, as, as I was working to help my client get their goals, I created a vision board on their behalf or a vision map so that I could then focus on helping them get what they wanted. Do you see how you can use this in multiple different ways? Maybe if you're a parent, you could use this with children and say, okay, I, I wanna imagine what my child's life would be like if they were having lots of friends and they had a great report card and they obeyed and they cleaned their room and they were helpful and they were so happy inside. And so, so you can, even, even if you never share this with the person, the, for example, the child, if it's something that you're focused on, your energy can go out and can help them shift and you will find solutions on their behalf. So there's so much power in these vision maps. I really just want you to understand and know that you can tap into a whole bunch of power and possibility and intention that you may not have known was there. I want you to be able to take advantage of all of your potential. And this is just one easy piece. It can be done in a half an hour. Um, something you can put together that can make a huge difference in your life and your mindset. Because once you know what you want, that brings hope. That brings 
possibility that, you know what, maybe I could have these awesome things in my life. And that builds momentum and that builds positive energy and, and opportunities open up. It's all connected to your mindset and, and using your subconscious mind as, as a servant or as a partner to help you achieve these things. So I hope this training has been meaningful. I, I'm so glad you took a moment to learn about this, to improve your life. I encourage you continue your education. I have other trainings on diving deep into your subconscious conscious mind all about what it does and what it doesn't do and even your conscious how it plays a part and your super conscious mind if you've heard of that I go into lots of detail there I have trainings on what comes after your vision map what about adding affirmations and words and if you've had trouble with affirmations you know how do we bridge those gaps how do we make those come alive and and we get over the the stuck part of not having things work and get into where it really feels like flow after affirmations what about vision broad Casting. What about really taking and emotionalizing and learning how to really just spread your energy and 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 see those things come into fruition that you want in your life and getting really good at that. And specifically, I've used this in business to achieve some great success and, and you can use it in your personal life as well, wherever you're wanting success. So watch for those trainings, also the Book of Proof I've mentioned, and, and just really take some time. I encourage you, don't procrastinate. Sit down, even if all you're doing is drawing pictures to, to do your vision board, you've got your map right you've got your template you know what it's supposed to look like and so if you don't have access to cut any magazine pictures out or do a google search and print some stuff off the internet take a stick it take take a post-it a sticky note and draw a representation and put a word with it of the things that you want start this today please do not go to bed until you've at least drawn some pictures like give your mind something to focus on and it will go to work for you Okay, I hope that's been been fabulous training for you. Please do let me know the the insights, the ahas that you've gotten from this, how you're implementing it, and what you're seeing as a result. I would love to celebrate your success with you. And in fact, that is why we set goals in the first place, so we can know when we've gotten there and when we can celebrate, and we can know we're doing what we want, we're on the path that we choose in life. So thanks for joining me. Again, I look forward to seeing you on the next training. Let me know all about your success. I would love to celebrate with you.